Summer's over. Well, except for local summer, but you get the point. And it's time to give out the final grade to the sixth annual Shore Summer Weekend Weather Report Card for 2023 right here at Ocean City High School. I got my number two pencils with me and I'm ready to give out the final grade. Now, after each weekend, I've updated my grade on pressofac.com and social media, and now it's time to see just how good of a pupil 2023 really was. First, let's get into the criteria. What makes an easy A? For me, it's a high temperature between 75 to 85 degrees, no rain, a gentle breeze, a sunny to partly sunny sky, and lower humidity. And remember, this is for the whole shore too. Just because there was one area of rain in Long Beach Island and everywhere else was dry doesn't mean we can't get an A. So in the 15 weekends between Memorial Day and Labor Day weekend, I gave out Bs. I mean a lot of Bs. 11 out of the 15 weekends were either a B or a B plus, And that included one solid stretch from the weekend of June 9th to the 11th all the way to August 4th and 6th. Which brings me to my next point, the weekend after that. We're talking about the weekend of August 11th to 13th, which for the first time ever gave out a minus grade to the report card. Really what happened was I spent way too much time determining whether or not this was a B plus or an A because there was just one storm along the shore that rained for hours at a time that Saturday. So an A minus felt right. Our one C plus was June 2nd to 4th. Saturday and Sunday were cold and smoky. Remember that earlier in the summer? On the other hand, the end of the summer was our best stretch, and that comes as no surprise. Both the weekend of August 18th to the 20th and Labor Day weekend were solid A's, jolting up our summer grade point average. So when Mother Nature left summer school for the last time, our 15-week grade point average, the 2023 Shore Summer Weekend Weather Report card grade was at 3.3, a B plus. And hey, I'm pretty darn happy with the B plus especially when you consider 15 different weekends from Friday to Sunday, sometimes even longer than that. Plenty of time for tropical cyclones, nor'easters, heat waves, whatever, to throw it off. Now, looking back at history, this puts the summer of 2023 in third place for the best shore weekend weather in the six years that we've done it. The top spot, just a 3.4 GPA, which happened last year, as well as in 2019. So as Ocean City High School fills it, I put the pencil back in my ear and we say goodbye to the Shore Summer Weekend Weather Report Card. Just know we did pretty darn good. We had a great summer here at the Jersey Shore. For the Press of Atlantic City, I'm meteorologist Joe Martucci.